Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bight Stadium with its tent light structure. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And both teams with one game each under their belt already. Let's see how they fare this time around. It's Argentina up against Poland. Well, Derek, after their draw on the opening day, it's vital they get three points at home today. This should be an intriguing game, I think. And so the match is underway. What can they do from here? Paredes, onto Di Maria, can they forge ahead? There it is, and just the ideal start. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Simon Zhurkovsky. Going well. They do pass the ball with authority. A fine use of the ball, showing patience as well as persistence in the build up. And a goal! Real excitement here, the equaliser. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Goal. So back Four underway, Poland. they've leveled it at 1-1 one, one here. Robert Lewandowski. Paredes, Rodrigo de Paul. Lo Celso on the offensive. Paredes to take the lead Martinez and no worries for the goalkeeper Martinez Messi offensive Brazilians to shut them down Karol Svidevsky he continues his run an astute piece of defending Martinez Di Maria Martinez options for Di Maria Martinez great opportunity Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's goal a good goal. And there it is, the half-time whistle. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. So the two teams have switched around, and the second half is underway. Jurovsky. Surely, and a goal! An end-to-end -end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch-perfect, and Lewandowski's finish was excellent. He times his run, he finds that bit of space, and he was never going to miss that. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Excellent defending. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. And it's Krikoviak. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. A wonderful intervention. Right, right. 
Giovanni Lo Celso. Otamendi. Marcos Acuna. They've won back possession. Into the final 20 minutes. Making sure nothing came of it. Well, he's certainly not alone. Zielinski. Can he put them in front? And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. Both substitutes have been getting ready. will come on at the same time. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Ten minutes left for play. And they keep the ball moving. Just the clearance that was needed. We might very well have late excitement here. Five minutes to go, and just one goal between them. And read perfectly by Otamendi. They're showing a willingness to attack, as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Marcos Acuna. Martinez! And now it's over. And Argentina have to reflect on what has gone wrong here. It's a defeat and not something that they were hoping to have to digest. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to